Here is a very interesting question. What is the difference between method overriding and method hiding? We already compa compared overriding and overloading and this is like the next level com comparison. Let's see the code of overriding. Here we are overriding the greetings methods in the derived class. Now when we create the object of the derived class then derived class method will be called, right? But sometimes we have to declare the object as base class and then create the object of the derived class like this. For example, uh, in, uh, like, uh, let me tell you a scenario. Suppose we have one base class and 10 derived class. Okay. Then we will just declare the obj derived variable as a base class. And then we will write the condition like if this condition is true, obj derived equal to new derived class 1. Else if this condition obj derived equal to new derived class 2. So similarly like so on and so on. So in those kind of scenarios, if you will call this greetings method, then it will call derived class method because this is expected from overriding, right? This is overriding to override the base class method. Now, what is method hiding? In method hiding, you can completely hide the implementation of the methods of the base class from the derived class using the new keyword. Now, let me show you the code. If you see, it is the same as overriding code except except the only difference is we have not used virtual and override keyword here rather a new keyword is present in the derived class method uh, it is not override it is new keyword rest of the things are like almost same now this new keyword will what it will do it will completely give a new meaning to this greetings method that means now this greetings method has no connection or relation with the base class greetings methods. In other words, in overriding, you are overriding the method. But here in method, method hiding, you are completely redefining the method. It is like completely a new method. And if you perform the same thing here, like creating the variable of the base class, then it will execute the base class method because the object is declared of base class so it will execute the base class method the conclusion is in overriding we override the method by using the virtual and override keyword but in method hiding we completely redefine the method with new keyword so the even the dotnet compiler will think it as a completely new method it will not think that it it is a overridden version of the base class method got it